So this is a bit of. We're playing Metal Gear Solid. It's kind of it's. This is a rare bit of because all four of us are going to watch you play Metal Gear Solid. I'm going to do this like an expert. No, you're not. No, I'm not. It's going to be a, a little bit of a. It's like thing. no something above an expert, right? Oh like, what's, yeah. What's no. better than an expert? Like uh, some like flawless game design. You're going to be breaking the game too, so it's going to be really cool. So as you watch Jeff play. <clears throat> You'll notice sometimes, like he'll be like running in circles for no reason, or he might get seen by a guard. You'll he be, be like, he'll get tactically he shot. Yeah, <laughs> tactical, <laughs> exactly. And what he's doing is he's manipulating the code tactical. in the background of the game. So yeah. by making it load certain bits of data into the system, so even he may even die a couple times. Yeah, oh, that's yeah. it's and all on purpose. It's all on purpose. It's all gonna let him do glitches later in the game. It's definitely not because he hasn't played it in what ten years more than that. Oh god, yeah. I played Metal Gear 5. Do you remember what year this came out? 98, I think. I want to yeah. say 98. Something like that. What does the actual yeah. difficulty do? It just turns the, it just turns radar, the radar off? off? Uh, it's more than that, I think. Yeah, but it's... I'm not doing that. So, <laughs> <laughs> See, what's odd is that when you select normal, normal is actually the hardest difficulty. Right. A lot of people... that unforgiving. Yeah, a lot of people don't know that. A lot of people will put it on extreme or easy, and that's they're both the same thing. But normal is the hardest. I remember this bit water technology yeah thinking about it so so again i played this on the gamecube oh, the hd the, well the, HD, the not well, really the, the twin snakes yeah. yeah but it was it definitely looked better than like this ps2 paul quality. otis yeah, yeah paul otis yeah. is in this he's great i don't know oh, I, I thought a lot of these i don't know if it was this printing of the game but one of the original printing of the games they had to use uh people's pen names because they weren't certain if this like abided by like SAG rules. Right. Oh, that's right because there weren't any. There weren't really any SAG rules at the time. Yeah. Like voice acting in video games wasn't really a thing regulated. Yet. I guess yeah. it wasn't really a thing. I don't know. But how many times do you think you've beaten this game from from start to finish? Quite honestly, I don't know. Maybe like three or four. Oh god, I've done way more. I've done at least eight. Because and then the remake, I probably played just as many times too, like, on GameCube. Oh, you, you did play Twin Snakes. Yeah, oh, I love Twin Snakes too. Because I was really excited when Twin Snakes I came out. I love David Hayter's voice. Loud and clear. What's the situation? I love how he repeats What's everything. The in the back is the only way up. Just as I expected. You'll have to take the elevator. There's really important plot points going on. Mm -hmm. Thank God for subtitles. If you need to, contact me by codec. The frequency is 140.85. That's the bit you had to remember. I think you do. And I'm probably going to forget. I'm pretty sure they they saved some numbers for you in the yeah, codec. Yeah, I think it's after the, you call them. But I'm, I'm not sure. I don't know if Kernels gets defaulted. Colonel, I ate some bad tacos. Yeah, what we don't realize is that all of these codec calls, like Colonel's on the toilet every single fucking time. Mm -hmm. It's just you see him from well could be. waist up. It's like the news reporter story that like they they never wear pants. They don't wear pants, yeah. yeah. So how, how old is Solid Snake supposed to be in this one? I think, honestly, in, like, the canon, he's supposed to be, like, 40s. Really? No. I think so. Like, he's, like, retired. He was supposed to be more... He's out of retirement. Well, obviously. I forget the... I feel uh, like he was in his... You're not going to get them rations? Here. Where do you see the ra Oh, down there. In the Wawa. Spinning rations. They're soggy. I'm walking the water. It's a lot different than walking on sunshine. <laughs> Once again, though, that's just an example of... So Jeff delayed in getting that ration until it was rotated in the right way. Yeah, he had to get to it at the right up. time in the game yeah. clock. Yeah, Were it, those uh, rats crawling around on the ground? Yes. It provides wow. a bonus if you... Uh, Attention to detail, huh? I have no idea. Now I don't remember any of the patterns. Jeff, there's a guy there. <laughs> that was not... What was that noise? This whole entire goddamn commentary is going to consist of us saying, like, what was that noise? <laughs> Snake. Well, I'm actually curious about what some of the noises are. Yeah, what was that noise? Maybe I love box? the fact that, that he's fucking whispering <laughs> into <laughs> your ear. Can hear. Yeah. Yeah, they just established that nobody can hear him but Solid Snake. <laughs> can you, oh, you fucked up. No, I didn't. Can you climb up on the boxes I or no? I don't think so. No, you can't climb on the, the box. Why are you going back? I didn't actually listen to what Colonel said. He's got to go to the elevator, but it's taking its sweet ass time coming down. Uh, you just got to wait out the the time it takes the elevator from getting to the top to where you are. Is that like the time it takes for the 
Yeah, like lies. opening credits to finish. They're just gonna <laughs> inspect not... this forklift. They're they're actually loading the hind D for the next scene. This did not what? I like this did not age great and like some of these like <laughs> the textures, but yeah, it's like it's kind of fucking with mine. Is distance. there like a remastered version of this for any of the later systems? Yeah, we were just this, talking about that the, the GameCube uh, version has the twin snakes. It's just it's this game, it just looks a lot better. And kind it, of I think it controls better too, to be honest. Yeah, yeah it does. Because yeah. you get full analog. Mm -hmm. Like, I have to use the D pads. I think there might be an option. And the GameCube for... controller is superior to the PS2 controller anyway. Wow. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> God, that's. Do you do you work for Nintendo? Does your dad work for Nintendo? <laughs> I work for Nintendo. Yeah, my uncle worked for Nintendo. He told me about this secret game. <laughs> this game's a secret. No one knows about yeah, it. Yeah, no one knows about it but me. I like the fact that the. Elevator with flashing lights and alarms doesn't set anybody's attention off. Well, well maybe somebody else is coming down. That. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, maybe the boss is coming. Who knows? <clears throat> oh, yeah, the stripping scene. <laughs> <laughs> oh, David Hayter. I gotta get into Kyle Reese Terminator position. Yeah. the reveal i remember like you know this is like the first game i played that was like this is like playing a movie even though that's probably been said to death but like i actually felt yeah. that way it's kind of like indicative of the, the games i kind of chose to like favorite or like mm -hmm. because like it says story but it's like a movie i'm kind of progressing the narrative in 1998 this that, that was like really groundbreaking because you you played video games and they felt like a video game or they felt like you're at an arcade yeah you know, and this felt like this was so story driven compared to everything else at the time. Not only that, but voice acting in video games was extremely limited oh, yeah. before that. That's true, too. I think that added a lot to the like, fact that like there was actually cinematography thought of in the production of this game, too. Yeah. Prior to this, it was just it's a me Mario. And those <laughs> sweet fucking the like, armor abs. Pack. Oh, yeah. my God. He's got a whole case of beer in his stomach <laughs> he's got a 24 pack this, yeah. this is gonna be a nightmare you really you're gonna get in there no problem are you kidding me i mean no, i'm gonna try to get all the stuff that i think is on the left hand side like that i don't exactly grenades. remember but like you, you did like two or three playthroughs before today right no just like ran through it real quick get your speed running time what, what, down what would speed run <laughs> 40 minutes done and of course we're gonna probably make a billion and a half uh, Metal Gear Awesome references because I think oh, of that's... course. How many hours does this take to complete if you don't like fuck around? A lot? Um, I think it can be done in a couple hours if like you were really good. It, well, if you knew exactly what everything was. If going into this, this game blind is, uh, I don't know. I, I, my first playthrough is probably maybe sixteen hours, something like that, maybe. Yeah. Well, I'm sure it helps to like know exactly where you're going ahead of time. Yeah, exactly. And how much stuff you can actually skip. There's a lot in this game that you don't have to do at he all. He just said something about a butt. What was that? A hindy. Yeah. It was a, it's that's, a helicopter. That's the chopper. I don't think he's talking about a butt. <laughs> you might be right. Slipping unnoticed into the butt. <laughs> I'm going to get in this high now. Uh, here we go. Refer <laughs> reference one. <laughs> it's so fun. It's so good. Uh, my, one of my favorite things about the Metal Gear Solid is that just the fact that whenever Snake sees something, he's like, uh, "Behind D?" Question mark. Or and then <laughs> somebody says Metal Gear, and he's like, "Metal Gear?" Question mark. Deadline. <laughs> Oh my god, it's a solid talking? snake! Yeah, reference to... There it is. I haven't introduced you two yet. This is Mei Ling. She was assigned to us as our visual and data processing specialist. Assigned by she whom? Assigned codec, as well as your Soliton radar system. Contact her if you... Gotta be honest, Colonel, you're throwing a lot of words at me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna take it as disrespect, actually. I'd like to speak to a, a living legend like yourself. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I just Anyway. Chinese. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm serious. Well, I know I won't be bored for the next 18 hours. 
Come on. It's kind of creepy. I can't believe I'm being hit on by the famous solid snake. I'll show you my famous <laughs> solid snake. You're very frank for a trained killer. Uh, Looks like we both have a lot to learn about each other. Are you talking about a penis? Yeah. I'm looking forward to learning about yeah. the man. Oh.